This device is a tracking device. As you can see, it's very small. Nine volt battery I have assembled onto the, the case that I made for the, for the circuit board. I just got some aluminum and I bent up a little box. It actually shields the radio frequency so you don't get interference. This box is grounded to the negative on the battery and the negative on the circuit board. Right there, that hole is for putting in the little plastic screwdriver for the trimmer capacitor. And you can adjust the frequencies from 80 to 150 megahertz. I put a little piece of spline from screening and I put the wire through the spline this way it doesn't touch the side of the uh, aluminum to short the antenna out. The circuit, I don't remember where I got it from. I just went looking for it online right now and I can't find it, but what this does, I have it set, you can detect this very clear between a, a quarter and a half a mile away. And you really don't want it any further than that, because if you do, then you can't pinpoint the location. And on the side of this, I put a neodymium magnet, so you can stick it on something. And the battery runs a long time. I forgot the milliamp drawer, but it's not much. And what else do I want to talk about here? And I'll show you the frequency on it. Right now it's on. Turn on my frequency counter. There you go. Right now it's on 114.5. Antenna's about a foot long. It's a good little circuit. If you want to track something, you can set the frequency you want, and like I said, up to a half a mile away you'll find it.